everyone talking about Danger Parfum Cologne or Om by Raja. The notes in this are lemon, bergamot, lavender, tarragon, lily of the valley, jasmine de grasse, violet, rhubarb, galbanum, clove, cumin, patchouli, oak moss, wood, vetiver, cedarwood, vanilla, tonka bean, leather, ambergris, and musk. From the way this is described, kind of, in a sense, from the brand itself and also kind of from, you know, just the general description that I've seen from some, I thought this might smell super dated. Uh, while there are certainly elements of, like, vintage scent profiles in it, to my nose, actually, this does not smell dated at all, really. It smells perfectly wearable from, like, a modern standpoint. It's aromatic, slightly soapy and powdery, classy, and kind of dark yet fresh at the same time. And something that Raja does with their, like, Parfum Cologne versions. So it's a little bit different than when they tip it when other places call something a cologne, which usually just means that it's a lower concentration of the fragrance, which is also true with uh, Raja's Parfum Colognes versus their Parfums, but their Parfum Colognes are still high concentration, but they call it that because it's a fresher take on the full-on Parfum version and a little bit lower, you know, concentration of the fragrance, but... Uh, I think this would be a really nice, like, professional, classy, masculine-leaning fragrance. The main critique I would give it is price. I actually do think that some Raja fragrances are worth the high prices. Like, some, you know, if you look in any reviews for any uh, Raja fragrance on some place like Fragranica, you're gonna likely find people just, oh, Raja stands, this and that, like, really hating it. It's crap, it's so overpriced. But I definitely think that a lot of them are, you know, really, this one's really nice too. Like, it's not that I don't think it's nice. Some of them are worth the price, like Elysium, obviously. But to me, this smells more like it shouldn't be more than like $160 as opposed to like over $300 at its price tab. $315 for 100 mil to be specific. Good longevity and moderate projection. And yeah, again, I do like this. This also isn't like my favorite. This isn't the type of scent category that I wear in terms of that kind of like more sophisticated yeah, like, uh, kind of slightly vintage but modernized, like, aromatic, soapy, powdery, classy type of vibe. So maybe it would be worth the money to you, and really cool bottle and stuff, I like that. And yeah, I like the scent too, so it's worth checking out, I think, a sample if you're interested in it. And I will link in the description where you can uh, do so.